Hello everyone, this is Melinda Storrs here and I wanted to show everyone how to create a button on their website. These buttons down here, get glowing skin now and learn about the business opportunity, have links behind them that will take them to my take my visitors to another page that they might be interested in. So I wanted to know how to do this and I figured it out yesterday so I wanted to put together a tutorial for you. So the first thing you're going to want to do is go to pagetutor.com forward slash button designer forward slash index.html. If you get to pagetutor.com and put in CSS button designer, this should come up. But this is the page you want to land on. So you basically just follow through these tabs. And let's see, what I did is I wanted my text, let's see, for glowing, get glowing skin now. Put that there and I wanted it to be at about 16 and I wanted the background to be an orange. I like orange buttons for some reason. So I just came over here, chose the orange, updated it. And then with the orange, I thought that white would look good. So I went ahead and hit the color again. There's the white. And update that. And then, so that looks great and I'm happy with that. So then I want to go to the mouse over to make it change a color when somebody gets to, when somebody scans over it or mouses over it I should say and so the background color I wanted it to change to green because I had some green going on on the the website so I chose this green and put that in there and so you can kind of it's neat because through this tutorial here you can just click on it and see what it'll look like so then after you do designer and mouse over, you just go to code and this is the header code and this is the actual button code. So what you'll do is take the header code and copy the whole thing. You want to make sure you're getting the whole thing. So I'm going to just copy it all and you're going to copy and then go to your dashboard and go down to the editor under appearance. And this will put the groovy butter, groovy button, groovy button software um, code in your header, so that it will allow the button to show up somewhere else on your website. So I just went down to the very bottom, found end header section, and I put my code. You can see right above that. Literally just pasted it. That's it. And then come back here. And then for the button code, I just copied here. And let's see. Okay, go to copy and then back to my theme and then to my widget because that is where I want my button. I wanted it right on the right sidebar. So my first text is, widget is my opt in box and my second one is the buttons. So for those of you that don't know, you just grab a widget, the text widget, and you put it over where you want it to be. And um, with my button, I wanted it towards the top. So this is the button widget, and I literally just pasted it, copied it, and pasted it. And then I did add a little bit of code here which is the quote unquote get and then let's see yep and that's that's it on the get and then I also added the action equals and found that from a HTML website explaining how to insert and what I'm going to do is on this post I'm going to 
bold the two additions that you have to put into the code and that's literally all you have to put in and you'll be you'll be good to go so once that was in and I updated my website I had my beautiful new buttons and this you know you click on this and then it goes to my product page which talks about the products that that I'm marketing so that's it that is how you create a button image to put on your website. I hope that was very, very helpful. And if you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment and ask me. And I hope everybody goes out there and makes beautiful buttons. Thank you for listening. Have a great day.